Hey everybody, you're watching the Dude's Kitchen and Grill and I'm your man Mike Wolford and we are back. Took a little bit of hiatus there helping Mrs. Dude out with wedding season, but we are back and today we're doing a queso dip. I've never done one before, but man, I am excited to do it. But before we do that, we have another sticker for the Fridge of Fame. This is my buddy Dave over at DeBomb Smokes. I'm gonna put his link up here somewhere, right in there somewhere. You've heard me talk about Dave before. He's the guy I won the book from that had all the spices in that. Still looking forward to doing that. So let's put the Bomb Smokes sticker on the Fridge of Fame. Like I said, my buddy Dave over at the Bomb Smoke, he gets to go on the Fridge of Fame. What do you think? Right there. Dave, you're looking good on the Fridge of Fame, buddy. All right, let's get back to doing our queso. All right, so first thing I have here is some dogs next door barking. You know how it is, cook with me. You gotta have dogs barking. I got a pound of ground beef. And this is actually the 37, no. And this is actually the 73, 27 ground beef. So we're just gonna cut it open. Dump it in like this. Next thing we have is a pound of ground pork and let it plop in like so to get a little bit more out you know how it is There's always something going on we're gonna put this on the Cuisinart grill cook this thing up we're gonna add some Uncle Steve's thick meat to it because I do dig that stuff and we're gonna let this cook down and then we'll be right back look at that it's come along really nicely I'm gonna add some Uncle Steve's thick meat to it. This stuff is good on just about anything. Give it a nice generous helping there. Mix it up. I'm gonna add a little bit more. All right, let's let this continue to cook. It's been about 10 minutes. Time to get, give this another check. This stuff is, is done. I mean, I don't want it too done because it's gonna finish cooking off inside the queso mix. So let's put it into the pan and let's start building our queso. I'm just gonna put this along the bottom here. Just dump it in. Just kind of spread it out like that. That looks good. Now it's time to start putting this together. First thing I'm going to do is chop up an onion. I'm going to use a whole onion for this. Throw that in there. Next thing I'm gonna do, it's got some a bell pepper here. I got is some jalapenos. Look at that. Man, that's looking good. Next thing I got here is I got some cheddar jack cheese. Dump it over. Now the best part's coming. This is just a Kroger nice and cheesy, but basically it's Velveeta.
all or nothing. Live large and in charge. Look at that. All right, we're not done yet. We're going for some paste picante. Over the top it goes. That is looking awesome. All right guys, we're gonna put this on the pellet grill at 225 until everything has melted down. We've hit that magical 250 mark. It's time to put these down. Look at that. Mmm, mmm, yum. All right guys, 250 in the pellet smoker until it's melted down. We'll be right back. I think we're at about the halfway mark on this. It's been about 20 minutes at 250. So let's just check it out. It's looking good. It kind of stirred up a little bit. I can get everything together. Start mixing these ingredients up. Everything is there. Oh man, if you can smell this right now, wow. Almost looks like a, I don't know, a lasagna or something. Man almighty, it smells amazing. Let's taste it. Mmm. Amazing guys, absolutely amazing. It's been another 20 minutes. And look at that. That is a thing of beauty. And my son, he said he doesn't like his quite like this. But you know what? I do. I think it's time to take it off. Let's take another look at this. This thing is a thing of beauty. Oh my goodness. Oh. I'm gonna, I took some chives that we have in our garden. I'm just going to sprinkle it over the top. Of course I cut them up. Seriously guys, you can't go wrong with that. I think it's time to try this out. Mm. Wow. One word. Wow. This is full of flavor guys. Just tons and tons of flavor. Amazing. I've got to try it again. Sorry guys. I wish you guys were all here. We could try this together. Mm. Perfect. Recipes down below guys. Give it a shot. I mean, it's not too difficult. You could do this inside in an oven. It would be no problem whatsoever. If you get a chance to do it outside, I say do it. All right, guys, you know the routine. Please remember to like, subscribe, ring that dinner bell for notifications, comment, share. You know we love your comments. We know you love it when you share. When you share everything, guys. It's good to be back. We'll talk to you soon. Remember, the dude abides this time with queso. Talk to you soon, guys. Mmm.